Donna, I just wanted to talk with you um, about being vegan during pregnancy. And um, you've been vegan for 11 years yeah. now. And then you, just with Eva, you were high carbohydrate, low fat vegan during pregnancy. Yeah. Can you tell us um, what do you recommend eating during pregnancy? During pregnancy, if you're having any, if, like if you can stay on your fruit and vegetables, fantastic. It's brilliant, perfect, raw. Uh, I, I couldn't, I had like 11 weeks where I was just, I needed something so dense and I wasn't feeling great. I'm used to feeling fantastic and I wasn't. <laughs> so what I'd recommend in those times is get so cozy with the potatoes and rice. Just go for it to your heart's content. If you keep your fats and your salts low, you're gonna have no problem at all. I, I certainly did not get fat on my pregnancy, and the weight stripped off straight after my pregnancy. Um, amazing, can we see your tummy? You can try. <laughs> She's looking amazing. So Eva's nine months now, and I um, yeah, gosh, within four weeks I was like almost back to where I was at beforehand. Wow. Um, less muscle. Less muscle tone, certainly less tone on my tummy. Um, but yeah, now it's I, I think I look better than before. Yeah, well, so, yeah, I think you're looking really amazing. Yeah. yeah. So I, I think it's uh, pregnancy's no excuse. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah. it's funny, isn't it? Because um, yeah, I think my mum and, and quite a lot of women that that she knows have said, oh well, you know, when you're pregnant, that's just what happens. It's really hard to get the the weight yeah. off, and um, you know, and it's really great that now I know, you know, some women who. That's really not the case because they have followed a high carbohydrate, low yeah. fat, vegan lifestyle and have just found their bodies bounce back. Yeah. Um, yeah, which is really great. So great to debunk that myth. Yeah. Um, the amount of calories I would eat in a day post pregnancy, it was sporadic during pregnancy. It was whatever I felt like on that day, at that time, at that moment. <laughs> but afterwards, it's been like 2,200 to 2,500. Calories a day, no problem at all. Mm, okay, great. Yeah. And can you tell us um, some how do you get your body back after pregnancy? Uh, a few things. So to get your body back after pregnancy, I'd say the preparation before pregnancy mm -hmm. is really going to help you. So if you've got the body that you want pre-pregnancy, uh, you can just strip straight back to that after. And I mean, I'm not like being just saying that lightly, like. If you're breastfeeding afterwards and you look after yourself and you eat clean and you eat high carbohydrate and nourish yourself, eat enough calories to get enough nutrients, uh, you absolutely can go straight to the back to the body that you that you had uh, and better. Uh, so that would be yeah, yeah. So that would be my tip is to do make the preparation because during pregnancy, forget about it. Like. You're not going to be thinking, oh, I need to go do a workout. Just, just don't bother. Like, <laughs> do what you need to do that day. If you feel like a walk, go for a walk. If you feel like a workout, go for a workout. Fantastic. But don't be thinking, oh, I need to sculpt my body um, right. during pregnancy. It's just, you just need to go with the flow. Pregnancy is all about the flow and day by day and being there for you and your little one. <laughs> and your little one. Yeah, awesome. yeah. Fruit and vegetables, eat them.